Say cheese! Good morning! We hope you're off to a beautiful, wonderful, extraordinary day. I have to tell you guys something stupid. I have made these now for about like four months. This is like the pancake mix I buy because we eat so much and it has added protein. I just noticed on the back that it says if you make it with eggs and milk, it makes it even more protein. And I feel like a bloomin' idiot because I would have done that the whole time. Like, oh my gosh. Are you a grape thief? Do you like your grapes? I had the hardest time in Walmart yesterday getting him not to reach his hand into the bags of grapes and eat them. <laughs> he got one and I was like, no, don't do it. Did you do it? Of course. He doesn't listen to me. <laughs> yeah, I too. YouTube. <laughs> um, we are trying potty training again today with Hudson. Yeah, He's gone pee pee on the potty twice today. Yeah, so he got a sucker. Hi, you? Yes. Are you being a big boy? Yeah. And I'm editing and worked and just doing that morning. Mostly our mornings are me working and editing. And Sky, I think, is getting ready to paint because it's nice today. I was supposed to have maternity pictures, but something we ordered for him didn't come in in time, and so we are going to delay them till next week again. <laughs> Time for some oobleck. Ready? One, two, three. Ooh. Hey. Whoa, that was so cool. There is a Dr. Seuss book about Ooblek, and I've never read it, but I really want to get it and read it to him just because we do play with it all the time. Yeah. And it's so fun. Abba. Abba. Hey. Oh my okay. goodness, you crumbled it. Do you love Ooblek? You don't need it. Hudson took a bath after um, he played with the oobleck, and so he has been running around Nike. But I'm so proud of him because he went pee pee on the potty, and he didn't even tell me he had to go. He just got up and went to the potty. So I'm really proud of him. He's curled up down there in his messy room, eating a cheese stick. And Sky just brought me a treat. Here's your Jack and Coke. My Jack and Coke. How about just my McDonald's Coca-Cola? Because they have the best Coca-Cola. What if you get a Jack and Coke at McDonald's? Wouldn't that be weird? I get a large Jack and Coke and a medium Cuban cigar. There'd be so many drunk drivers. I just put so much effort into making lunch that I'm going to have no motivation to make dinner. Just saying. But it should be good. And guess what, babe? Hmm. He got up onto the couch and went potty all by himself. He didn't even tell me that he had to go potty. He just got up and went what? in the potty. He was good. I'm very proud of him. These are pizza sliders that I made for lunch. He says they're good. I haven't tried it yet. Are you all snuggled up warm? Uh, and you, Mama. I love you, my Hudson. He works so hard, you guys. He's amazing. Just think, after you get this done, you'll be all done. I know. And you won't have to do it, hopefully, for years upon years. Whew. I feel like all I've done is clean. Not really, because I worked all morning and played with Hudson. But I just, like, organized this. I reorganized this cupboard, trying to get, like, more practical. And then I did dishes. And now I'm cleaning the counters. 
but seriously, like, one of the weird things about growing up is you don't realize how much your mother did, like, granted, my mom, like, everybody worked, my mom worked, and my dad worked, and we weren't home during the day, but, like, still, my mom always had dishes done, and she always cooked dinner, she always, like, always had the house clean, our house was, like, never messy, I don't know how she did it, like, I cannot keep up at all. She always had her laundry done. Granted, like, I did my own laundry and stuff like that once I was of age, once I was in, like, fifth grade. But, like, before then, she always had laundry done. She always had everything done. I don't know how my mom did it because, I, like I said, I cannot keep up. Every, like, every day our house becomes a huge disaster and it takes me forever to clean it up again. I don't know. I don't know. Where are we, Hudson? You don't have to see the werewolf. We'll go around, okay? No. We'll go around. You don't have to see the werewolf, but we are at Home Depot. A werewolf. A what? Werewolf. I see. The werewolf's gone. Look at the Christmas stuff. Do you want to look at the Christmas trees? Look, there's no more werewolf. He's like, look at the Christmas he's tree. Look, he's gone. There, he's gone. There's reindeer up there. It's Christmas now, somehow. Come look at this tree. He's terrified. He won't go. Look, there's pine cones. He's pulling. He says no. I think we scarred him and he's never gonna go to that side of the store. Even though it's all Christmas now, there's like no Halloween stuff over there. Oh, daddy needs to go right here. It's okay. <laughs> but he was pulling me. He's like, heck no. Uh, no, not today. Yeah, it's a Christmas tree. He's pointing to the Halloween stuff because he's found it. And he was pulling me towards it and now he says, heck no. Okay, we're going to go this way though. This way. Go this way, Goom. He can't decide if he wants to be scared or not. No. Look, it's not even over there. Here you go. Ha. Wait, look at Mama. <laughs> you gotta hold it. Ready? Say cheese. <laughs> I think those are a little big. Alright, no more Bubba. Only the two. Can you put him back now? No, we're just gonna go look at the car. It's okay. No werewolf. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they did have all the scary things set up over there. We got pizza, and somehow it was our lucky day because it was supposed to be ten dollars. But the lady said it was only five, and we don't know why, but yeah. So, he got five dollar really good pizza. So that's cool, but he kind of needs to lift it up because it's falling out of the pan. <laughs> Too buttery. <gasps> Feel right here. She's got the hiccups. Okay. Yeah, she's got the hiccups. Say... Can you tell her hi? Hi, hi, hi. Say, hi. Right, say to mama's belly. It's so good, it makes him fly. Alabama's cute. Alabama fans. <laughs> are you swimming now? Are you swimming? What are you rolling it? What are you doing? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. He just asked to sing. 
Happy birthday, and he's like, happy birthday to you, mama, happy birthday to you, sister, happy birthday, dear somebody, happy birthday to you. <laughs> Don't show them your food. It is almost bedtime for this bonzo, so we're going to end the vlog here. We hope you had a beautiful wonderful uh, extraordinary day that is so yucky yeah yeah anyways um yeah thank you for watching we love you guys and we will see you tomorrow can you say good night <laughs>